a land of myth and a time of artificial intelligence. Humanoid robots with glowing red eyes patrol the courtyard, casting long shadows across the ancient stones. Terrified humans flee through a stone archway, their faces etched with fear as they seek escape. Emerging from the shadows, the young man steps into the torchlight. A hidden plan flickers in his eyes as the music intensifies. In the castle courtyard, a young man holds up a scroll. A pulse of light radiates from it. Nearby, robots glitch and stumble, their movements becoming erratic. A magical shimmer fills the air, static crackles nearby. The scroll glows, revealing the words, Magic Light AI. The intro video you guys just watched was made possible by just one platform and it's called Magic Light. And the whole entirety of that intro was created in about five minutes without any editing skills required. Now, before we get on with the video, if you guys haven't subscribed to this channel, can you hit that subscribe button right now and make sure you also tap on the bell icon so that you get notifications to know whenever a new video is uploaded on this channel. So now the platform I'm going to be introducing, like I mentioned, is called Magic Light AI. And what this allows you to do is basically create any AI videos you may want. And the only limit you have using Magic Light AI is your imagination. You can literally create everything and anything as long as you can create a good script and storyboard for it and you do not need any crazy editing skills for you to start using the magic light ai platform now, let's get right into the video so now once you open the magic light ai official website i'm going to be putting a link in the description for you guys to be able to come directly to the website the first thing you're going to do is you're going to tap on the start for free button and then you're going to be brought to this dashboard and then once you're brought to this dashboard you have to log in to the platform so you can see the login button right here so i'm just going to tap on that and then i'm going to be logging in with my email and then i'm going to be logging into my account you can see my email right there then i'm going to tap on continue and now you can see login successful i have successfully logged into my account now on my projects right here you can see the intro of this video this is what you guys saw at the beginning i created this in like i said before less than five minutes then scrolling down you can see tutorial videos on how you can use the magic light ai platform like what i'm doing right now then you can also see other videos now you can see community videos right here there are lots of good community videos right here now once you are in your dashboard there are two things you can start with you can start by creating an ai video immediately you can see that right here or you can come right here to create an ai character now why will you have to create an ai character you create an ai character because of consistency now let's say you're someone that creates videos on tiktok or you create videos on youtube story videos trailer videos and all that where you need to have a consistent character you can come here and create a consistent character to, for yourself and then save it on your platform so that in subsequent videos you are creating you already have a character down that you can be using for your stories then when you're done with the story you can come right here and create another character for another story you can create as much characters as you want on the magic light AI platform or you can also use pre-existing characters on the platform now we're going to get right into how you can create ai videos using the magic light ai platform the first thing you're going to do is you're going to tap on create ai video and then you're going to be brought to this simple dashboard and now you can see that magic light ai takes a simple four step approach to creating videos now the first is the content the second is the cast the third is the storyboard and the fourth is editing now the first thing you're going to do is you're going to pick an aspect ratio for your video now if you're someone that uploads on youtube you're going to be using the landscape option now if you're someone that uploads on youtube shorts or tiktok or any other shorts uh, posting platform you're going to be using the portrait mode which is your smartphone screen size aspect ratio but for this video i'm going to be picking the landscape mode since i'm using a laptop for this and i'm going to be uploading this as a long form video on youtube now you can pick your video language you can see there are a lot of languages right here so i'm going to be using english and then you're going to be picking a style of your video so for this video we are going to be picking disney since disney is one of the best cartoon styles now we're going to come right here to create a simple storyboard so i can just write now you guys can see the simple script i wrote here and then you can see what chargpt has created so i'm just going to copy this script and then i'm going to be pasting it on the magic light ai platform 
and then we can pick our video duration magic light ai is one of the only ai tools out there that allows you to create 20 to 30 minute videos now for this video i want this video to be about three minutes long so i'm going to tap on three minutes and then we are going to tap on next now you guys can see the script has been generated successfully and the script is broken down into 28 shots so you can see the different shots and the different subtitles you can see all the scenes and you can see all the shots so it's seven scenes and 28 shots and you can delete any scene that you feel like is not necessary if you read through so now i think we are good with all the shots and all the scripts so now we're going to tap on next now once you go to next you are going to be introduced to the cast that's all the characters that are going to be in your story you can see rena which is a young female you can see ben you can see a red adult a blue adult because you saw that in the script i'm trying to make a script where they are there's a red village and there's a blue village and they don't mix so you can see red adult blue adult a guard and then an elder now you can edit these characters anyhow you may want now you can see rena is a female she's a young adult now i'm going to tap on rena if i want to edit rena's character i can change her name from rena i can also change the voiceover of rena if i want her to use any other of these voices i think i'm going to be changing rena's voice to sophia's voice so instead of this rena is going to be using sophia's voice rena is a female and she's a young adult now you can come here to select any of these characters and now because i talked about consistency before you can come to your character if you have already created the character and you can use that in your story now for rena right here we're going to be picking this 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 looks simple enough so we're going to be confirming that and if you want to do further editing you can also come back to rena and then you can see our agenda is female you can pick her age i'm going to be putting that as a young adult so once you pick that she's also going to be shown other characters that are young female adults and then you can just use that to make your search more narrowed so i'm going to tap on confirm now so now guys you can see that we have tailored all our six characters you can see all our six characters right here and all our characters are completely different now we're going to tap on next to create the storyboard using those characters okay guys so you can see right there our storyboard has now been created and we are now in this third step of the process so you can see from number one right here we are from one all the way to 28 different storyboards of these storyboards have different images different feel different subtitles and everything corroborates together to create the complete story from the prompt that i have created now you can also decide to edit any of the shots and literally edit anything you want in the video the first is starting with the voiceover speed i think i'll provide the voiceover speed to be a little bit slower so i'm going to be putting that at one times then the voiceover is going to be by any of the characters we're going to be picking theme as the one that is going to be the main character of the story doing the voiceover and you can see the prompt of each script uh, right here of each part of the storyboard this is the prompt of the first storyboard this is the prompt of the second storyboard the prompt of the third storyboard and then if you don't need any of the storyboards or you feel like it does not incorporate well inside the story you can either delete the storyboard completely or you can edit the prompt and then regenerate the prompt again now one thing i really like about magic light AI is all these are currently static images creating a story but now if you wanted to animate this let's say this can be a wide shot or a bird's eye view you can come right here down and then you can just tap on animate to animate this scene now i found out something even better now instead of going and clicking on each storyboard to animate each of the storyboard if you try to go next it's going to ask you if you prefer animating all your storyboards so now you can just tap on animate all you can pick which of the storyboards you want to be a static image and which of them you want to be animated and then you're just going to tap on next but me right now i prefer that every single frame of my storyboard right here is animated so i'm going to be animating every single one of them so as long as everything is selected you're just going to tap on next and then you can see there is lip sync for those shots where you have different characters you can decide to add a lip sync and then you can use animate pro to animate the shots you can use runway to animate the shots or you can use halo ai to animate the shots so now for this i'm going to be using halo ai 
to animate because i've used this in the past and it's actually very good then you're going to tap on confirm now animating 28 images will cost you 4200 credits when we started this video if you check your dashboard you're going to see that you are going to have some free credits at the beginning and then you can purchase credits for you to be able to do more on the platform now i'm going to tap on confirm we're just going to wait for that to animate and then we are going to pick up the video so guys now we are done with the storyboard and all the shots are done animating you can see every single shot now has this video icon in front of it meaning it's now animated we can play the first clip and you can see that it now shows an animated view instead of just a static image and it did that to every single shot here so you guys will just review the shots and if you're happy with the shot you can leave the shot if you're not happy with the shot you can change the prompt and then you can regenerate that particular prompt so i'm pretty happy with this and then since i've used this a lot i found out that it really has bad shots after animation so we're going to leave it as it is and then if you have empty shots like this and you want to add on screen characters to them you can just add any of your characters to the shots and then they're going to be shown on the screen and now we are done with that and then we are going to tap on next to go to the last step in this process which is to add a cover to what we have just created so i'm going to be using this shot as the cover and then you can see the cover title colors of the heart and then the cover style title you can just pick any style over here so i think i'm going to be using this style Okay, this style looks a little bit better then once we are done picking the style you can come to the subtitle settings i prefer simple subtitles so we are just going to be using this and then you can add background music it will automatically pick a background music for you that it feels like goes with the story so it already applied this but you can decide to pick any of these if you wish then now once you're done with all that you will now tap on generate for you to create the complete video so guys the video has now been completely generated you can see and then you can download the work after you submit it so i'm going to tap on submit and then publish the work and now you can see that is now in our project if i go to my project you can see it right here so now let's watch the completely generated video a stark unnerving division cleaves the valley the red village stands in crimson defiance against the azure expanse of the blue village across the chasm Villagers from both sides glare with mutual distrust, their eyes mirroring the deep-seated animosity that festers between them. In a land where colors ruled, red and blue never mixed. Under the cloak of night, Rena and Ben venture from their villages to converge deep within the forest. At the heart of the woods, they meet beneath a glowing tree, its light a beacon in their secret world. United by joy, they laugh and intertwine their hands, but two hearts saw beyond color. They tenderly exchange tokens of affection, a vibrant red flower and a delicate blue ribbon. Rena and Ben stand in the center, encircled by villagers, consumed by fury. Red and blue adults erupt in shouts, their fingers stabbing at the air with accusation. Gods and elders force a path through the throng, determined to tear the lovers apart. The villagers turn away, their faces twisting with disdain. Rena and Ben wander through the Grey Lands, dwarfed by the desolation. They reach a hill overlooking the villages, a silent promise hanging in the air. Together, they kneel and plant a small tree, a symbol of hope. The tree's leaves glow with a soft, purple light, a testament to their unity. The couple walks back into the valley, a path of uncertainty winding before them. Villagers gather, their faces etched with a mixture of surprise and apprehension. They return not with anger, but with hope. The tree behind the couple has grown, its purple glow a beacon of change in the valley. Red and blue villagers advance cautiously, their expressions a canvas of hope and trepidation. Two children, reflecting the adult's uncertainty, reach out and touch hands. The stark division begins to soften, new colors gently blending. Purple flowers bloom spontaneously, their delicate petals unfurling in the warm sunlight. Inspired by this transformation, the villagers work together, their brushes moving in unison. And soon, they all saw colors shine brighter together. The once divided village now stands united, homes of red and blue adorned with purple, a testament to newfound harmony. Children, once separated by color, now play together, their laughter the soundtrack of unity. Beneath the intertwined branches of their tree, 
Rena and Ben stand together, symbols of a love that knows no bounds.